it's me, myself, and Mandy, and we're in the car because I am on my way to see Barbie World. <laughs> Let's do it. I'm really excited to get to go see Barbie World. I quite enjoyed Barbies growing up. I played with them quite a bit. Um, I was really a animals kid, so any kind of stuffed animals, toy animals, I really, really loved the um, Barbie horses and Barbie pets. But then of course you have to have a Barbie to take care of the horses and the pets. I loved making stories with my Barbies. So Barbie was a big part of my childhood. So I'm pretty excited to let out my inner child today and go check out what we can see at Barbie World. They were playing pop music throughout the experience, which is really fun, but also means this video will have minimal audio. I love that Barbie has macaroons. Just sitting at Barbie's desk. Her beach house has a great view. You have to have accessories. Barbie's beach house pool is a ball pit. Too bad I'm too big to play in it. I just love this boom box. When at the beach house, we have to stop by the beach. There was also a Barbie fashion runway. And I was told I had to pose in each box. <laughs> Even the floor is fun. <laughs> and pink, of course. There was a music studio that you could interact with and record things. And a Barbie theater. Playing Barbie movies, of course. We got to dream of ourselves in different careers. I made myself a chef. One of the best parts, we got to see and get in the Barbie camper. And no, I didn't attempt the hammock. Looks like we have all the necessities. This is pretty nice, but it was not easy getting out of that chair. There was a Barbie museum that was really interesting, tracing the history of Barbie.
seeing Barbie's first dream house life size was amazing. The TV was playing the commercial for this dream house. And what dream house is complete without a car? It was so cool to see the actual dream houses through the years side by side. The Barbie Labs had actual working microscopes, which was so neat. And some interactive elements with color mixing and the periodic table. Time to do some Barbie weather forecasting. That's some rain, I think, over here in this general area. And here we're going to have some sunny weather right around here. Spring's coming early. <laughs> And of course, we exit through the gift shop. Well, it was really fun. We had a great time and I'm really glad that we went. It's not a huge, ginormous exhibit that spread out really big. There's still a lot of things to look at and a lot of things to experience as you can see. And it was really fun getting to walk through all those things and interact with these Barbie things and get to feel like, you know, we were Barbie <laughs> and play in her, uh, inside her Barbie dream house and inside her camper, just like we had always dreamed to be doing as kids. So there were a lot of kids there that it was really fun seeing them just really get into it and really enjoy being in the Barbie world and that was amazing. But it was also really fun to see the adults and the parents of the kids really getting into it too. I saw one group that were taking turns with the moms taking pictures of the kids sitting down and then they would switch out and the kids would take pictures of the moms sitting down and getting to enjoy it too. So it was really an experience for everybody and we were really glad that we went and it was just amazing and so fun. It was really a trip down nostalgia road. But now I'm heading back home to lounge for the rest of the day and I hope you also have a wonderful day. Bye.